my second child, I really had a lot of pain in my pelvic floor. And I didn't really know how to um, describe what I was feeling because it was new to me. I didn't have the same kind of pain the first time that I had my child. So I remember that after I delivered him, if I would carry his um, baby seat, I began to feel a lot of pressure and pain in my bottom. And it actually caused some tearing. And then I had to go to my doctor and they had to do stitching in the office. But nobody told me how to support my muscles when I lift something after I had a baby. And for whatever reason, it didn't happen the first time, but now the second time, and here I am having to take care of a toddler and lift up the, the seed of my newborn. And it created so much pain and so much um, problems for my, my muscles here that I actually tore even without the trauma of birth. Um, sex was always painful uh, after that, and I really had to seek help to get my muscles to relax and open. But Nowadays, no one is telling patients or telling women how to um, support their muscles after they have a baby, how to get your body to be more supportive in your lifting, in your daily activities. Um, no one told me that after you have a baby, you need to make sure that you're supporting your muscles before you lift your newborn or when you're putting them in the crib. I think every woman needs to know that. I think everybody needs to have a program where they know what tools they can use after they have a baby to strengthen their bodies, to strengthen their um, pelvic floors that has been through trauma, even if you've had a C-section. Um, I believe that we really lack the knowledge, particularly in this country, to, um, to just to know how to do that automatically. We need providers to tell us. We need people, experts, to train us in this area. I think that if we don't, we see more and more problems as women have children, as, as women try to recoup even you know, a year or two or three or four down the line. They just, the same recurrent problem, either incontinence or rectal pain or something of that nature. So um, we really do need education on how to strengthen our bodies from the inside out.